greetings and welcome to your new video i hope you're all doing well so guys if you want a windowed multitasking for your apps on ios you can follow this guide as you can see for example i have these three open settings weather and cilio and you can see i can work with them simultaneously without any issues and you will get this minimize button here you can simply tap it and simply drag an app anywhere on screen then simply tap it to maximize it you can also use this close button to simply close and open app just like that without any issues also if you configure a setting for this tweak in settings you will be able to also resize an open window for an app without any issues and you can see it right here you can also simply press and hold here at the corner and you will get the minimize option the close option and if you want to kill the app all together please note that this guide requires a jailbreak and the guides for all your compatible devices and ios versions is in the description now guys for this tutorial i have a device jailbroken with mu break on ios 15.8.1 yes i tried it with neko jailbreak when i was 15 or with palerin jailbreak rootless it worked just fine so once you are jailbroken simply open cilio then go to sources and you will have to add this source dc sy hi 1998.github.io you can simply add a source by hitting this plus button then typing the source here and then hitting add source i have already added it to save your time simply get to the source go to all categories and you will find here zetsu so you can see rootless because i am jailbroken with rootless so simply open it so yes it will work on rootful and rootless on i was 15 but it will work on rootful only if you are jailbroken with the latest version of ios 16 all right now simply hit get queued and confirm and let it complete it will get all the required packages for you all right guys once complete hit this button to user space reboot your device it will take about one to two seconds all right so guys after the user space reboot go in go to settings first then scroll all the way down and you will see zetsu here just hit it and then please enable it from here and then hit this button above and then simply respring all right when you go in you can simply tap and hold any app so for example we have settings so press and hold and you will see zetsu here just hit it and you will be able to open an app in windowed mode without any issues so i will try another one just hit it select and then you can see we can work with the apps simultaneously without any issues and you can see i have also opened safari and you can see it works very well without any problem you can simply minimize your apps maximize them or simply close them using the close button right here all right so it works great now if you want to resize your windowed apps you can simply head to settings then again go to zetsu then enable window using this button all right or you can limit the range of movement if you want using this button all right so after enabling the window mode now when you open an app using zetsu you can see that you have this button here and simply drag it to change the size of a window like that and also you can simply press and hold here to shrink or minimize it or to close it or to kill an app now you may be asking will it work on ios 16 so let me show you all right so we are quickly at our ios 16 device 
which is jailbroken on iOS 16.7.5. When you install this tweak on iOS 16 latest version, I recommend using Pelerin root full, not root less. Because if you use the root less for the Pelerin jailbroken on iOS 16, it can send your device into safe mode when you open any other app, for example, settings or any app. And likewise, when you install it on iOS 16 root full, you can simply go to source and you can see we have the Zetsu rootful. So install it and use it. And it works great here as well. As you can see it right here. No problems whatsoever. Also guys, the method shown in this video along with Zetsu is completely free. So enjoy it. That's all for this video. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.